a struggle. I mean, there's no other word for it. It's We've separated all our tables. We are sanitizing everything. When someone gets up, the tables are sanitized, the salt and temperature are sanitized. Anything that goes to the table is thrown away. It never goes back. It's never used by another person. We've added the, a little more patio seating, and then this year we bought the four picnic tables so that the people can be outside. Um, we do ask people to sanitize. We do ask them to put a mask on. We're seeing a lot of new people. Um, actually, we're seeing the younger people. We're not so much seeing our older seniors. It's mostly carry out. It's mostly patio seating, outdoor seating. And I'll be honest with you, all the carry outs, it's much more expensive for us to do. Like everything is in a single serve portion. You know, you, the box, the, the wrappers, the bags, the, it's, it is more expensive to operate that way when you're not used to it. It is difficult because we're not, a grocery store where I can go, okay, I bought this for $5.99, I'm going to sell it for X amount of dollars. My prices are in place, and if something comes in at a higher price, I can't go change it on the menu. I have to, we have to take that loss for that and then try to recoup it some other way. We're, we were going to retire about five years ago and we just couldn't do it. We are too involved in the community. But we said, okay, we'll go another five years. This is the end of our five years. So, and now it's like, do I put it up for sale? Do I not put it up for sale? I don't really know how COVID has affected this. And it's it's my baby, I'm sorry. I, I, I love it here, I love the people, and I want to make sure that my staff is taken care of. Uh, if this continues much longer, I, I don't know how, you know, how much longer that we can go with the less hours. So it's that unknown again. You don't know how long you're here for. And I have everything. My entire life has been invested in this place.